Yo, what's up, peeps? My name is Hernando, and welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far, man. Now, in today's video, we are going to be showcasing a couple of secret spots and locations that you guys can visit on Grand Theft Auto 5. Now, mind you, we recently got a brand new DLC update to GTA 5, so of course, Rockstar pretty much patched everything. So I'm going to be giving you guys an updated list of some secret spots you guys need to come visit and you probably didn't know about in the game itself. So before we go ahead and get things started up today, I thought I'd let you guys know about this secret little feature that YouTube has implemented recently. You guys know that, you know, the, the, the YouTube is always updating and stuff. So they did this thing if you guys like drop a like in today's video and hit that like button like three times in a row, you get the special feature pop up for your screen and you get it for enabled in your account which is pretty awesome so make sure you guys leave that like button hit it three times and one out of ten people will go ahead and see it so let me know down below in the comments what you guys saw popped up in your screen and as well subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand spanking you i would hate it if you missed out any of my brand new videos with that being said let's go on ahead and get things started up we are going to be showcasing a secret area on the game that you guys can access it now, all you guys have to go ahead and do is make sure that you enter a helicopter and then you want to make your way towards the city. Now, we have to go ahead and make sure that we do this right unless you guys want to go ahead and fall and die. But <laughs> regardless, you guys want to meet me all the way here on the map exact location that you guys want to head towards in order to enter this place now once you guys get here you guys want to go ahead and parachute your way down and make your way towards the exact spot that i'm going towards now if you guys have done it correctly then you should be right on top of these like little rails and then you're inside this area now the cool part about this is the only way you can actually access this is if you guys go ahead and use a helicopter so i guess normal players won't go ahead and follow you up here unless they use that now the cool part Part is if you guys also travel towards the corner of this building and fall down for a little bit you should now access the little bottom floor of the building itself a very interesting area construction site that hasn't been completed and you guys can enter here with you and all your friends now if you guys are looking for a way to you know snipe some people or going ahead and hiding from some cops of some sort or any place whatsoever then you guys can go ahead and chill in this spot or do some funny moments with you and your friends that you guys want to go ahead and uh, play with alrighty so now moving on forward towards the next thing that we got right here is going to be showcasing how you people can enter the police station now I'm not sure if you guys remember this but but this glitch used to work a couple of months ago but rockstar did recently patched it i guess people were abusing this of some sort with some god mode glitch i'm not too sure but now we have a brand new working method so you guys want to go ahead and make sure that you guys have your little mini vans like this one right here that you guys can commonly find around the streets of los santos so make sure that you go ahead and copy yourself one of these cars now you guys want to make your way towards the police station now of course this glitch is a little bit tricky, of course. A lot of people actually do have some trouble trying to make this glitch actually work for them. But, of course, if you guys keep trying and trying and trying, eventually it will work for you. And, I mean, it worked for me, dude. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty bad with glitches myself. So, this is pretty much easy if you have some dedication, some time towards it. And you can also use this to enter with you and your friends. So, everybody and the whole freaking you know lobby can go ahead and play with this so you guys want to meet me all the way here on the map like i said earlier here is the police station that we're going to be wall breaching inside of now that you guys are finally there you guys want to go ahead and drive your van all the way towards this spot and you want to make sure that you guys actually angle it in a specific spot that i have it right here where you can try to squeeze in now i know it might sound weird because i said squeeze but basically that's what we're going to be doing in this video we're going to be squeezing right inside of this door and we're going to be entering from here now here is what you guys want to go ahead and do now that you have your vehicle parked in that specific spot you guys want to jump downstairs and make your way towards the corner here now basically the game won't be able to get you guys up so you should glitch right outside of the car and then and eventually if you guys keep trying this a couple of times it should just glitch you right inside of the door it's a little bit tricky and you guys were going to be doing this for a while but eventually if you guys do it correctly and your character falls just like that your character should literally just wall breach right 
right inside of the freaking police station. And I know it's a little bit hard and difficult to actually go ahead and do, but you can literally get you and your friends to enter this spot if you keep trying again and again and again. This glitch used to work, but you know, unfortunately Rockstar patched the easier method, but of course now we can make this work again and you and your friends can enter this place and explore the police station and all it majestic glory but anywho moving on forward towards the third thing that we got right here you guys want to meet me all the way in the map in this location and you guys are also going to be needing a very tall vehicle so make sure you guys get a truck or a barricade or any of that to climb on top of this and then now you want to make your way towards the top of the ladder there's going to be a second one so make sure you guys climb on top of it and when you get to this spot all the way on the top you guys want to hug the wall and once you hug the wall it'll make it where your character doesn't fall down towards the little hole right there and just like go and approach the wall right here and your character should literally just climb on top of the freaking thing right there and you should just fall inside. Now something very, very interesting that I found out about this building complex is the fact that this was gonna be one of the warehouses used for the finance and felony. Now I guess Rockstar actually scrapped the idea because if you guys actually pay attention to this, it does really, really resemble a building that was gonna be used for the finance and felony warehouse buildings. If you guys pay attention to it and look around, you will notice some very small little details and actually interior designs that match up with the other warehouses in the game itself. But again, Rockstar did remove it, or my best guess is Rockstar is gonna be using this building for a different DLC or thing that they have planned up later down the line. But yeah, guys, this is basically another place that you guys can visit. So if you guys wanna go ahead and hide from the police officers or get away from other police who are trying to kill you, make sure you guys make your way all the way towards there and you guys will be fine. And just in case you guys wanna go ahead and exit, just fall down from the ground right there and you guys should spawn somewhere else on the map. So make your way all the way towards the map location that I just showcased and you guys will be all the way towards Lester's factory. This is from the single player and basically what we're going to be going ahead and doing here is entering the building. Now as of online, you guys cannot enter it whatsoever but with this glitch, you guys will have no problem whatsoever. So make your way towards the back of the building and you guys will notice a ladder. Go ahead and climb it to the roof and you're going to go up a little up more ahead and you're going to notice another ladder. Go ahead and climb on top of it once again and then once you guys make it to the roof you will notice that there's going to be a couple of windows. Go ahead and get to any of the windows and take cover and once you guys go ahead and do that you want to pull up your phone and enter job list and go ahead and accept any invitation towards a job list that you guys see. It doesn't really matter which one you pick it can literally work for any one of them and once you guys get to the lobby you want to go ahead and exit. Now once you guys exit your character should glitch right under the building and you should be right inside. If it doesn't work make sure you guys do it again because it should work for you no problem. But here it is people we are now inside Lester's factory and this is from the single player if you guys didn't know that and of course we are now all the way inside if you guys want to go ahead and get all your friends to you know just visit here or play around or do a couple of mini games inside of here you guys are free to do so i thought i'd showcase this to you people just to let you know now moving on forward we are going to be showcasing a very interesting wall breach so you guys want to go ahead and meet me all the way here on the map and you want to climb the ladder so once you guys go all the way on top of here, you're going to notice that there's a spot that you guys can actually enter from. So right here on the roof, you guys want to make your way towards this spot right there. And when you guys see this window right here, you just want to keep running forward towards it and you should now be able to enter it. And basically you guys can go ahead and have fun. It's another very interesting wall breach that not a lot of people actually know about. And you basically have a God mode unless you shoot a rocket at yourself and kill yourself. Now the next one that we're going to be showcasing is how to get inside of this house because apparently you can wall breach inside of it so meet me all the way here on the map and you want to park any motorcycle right in front of the door now you guys want to go ahead and try to jump on top of the motorcycle itself and then eventually you should be able to like literally grab on the ledge of it so if you guys want to go ahead and use this to get away from players or the police or any of that sort of stuff you guys can hide up on here and just fuck some shit around or if you want to get here and play with your friends and do some of that sort then you can go ahead and 
you know, you're afraid to do so. So yeah, that's pretty cool, man. And that pretty much does it for today's video. If you guys went ahead and enjoyed, make sure you support the video by hitting that blue thumbs up. I would appreciate it ever so much. And as well, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. With that being said, I'll see you later and peace.